Hi, my name is Hetal and in this video we are going to talk about the hypothesis feature under the plan section. So hypothesis is an assumption that we are going to create based on the issues identified in observations. So let's try to create a hypothesis. Hypothesis are created on the basis of observations. So here I identified an issue where I see the visitors are not submitting the sign up form. Now, if this is the issue that I want to address, what is it that I expect? So you can give up a solution over here saying that if this is a change that you implement, you will get a specific result. So I expect that if I reduce the number of steps, steps in this form, I will get more form submits, right? So you're trying to create a solution based on the assumption saying that if you do this specific change, you are going to address this problem. So the problem is having fewer form submits, right? So this way we can create a hypothesis. Now, apart from just giving these details, you can also give it a priority score. Now, the reason why we have to give it a priority score is that when you have multiple assumptions that are going to be created, with the help of this priority score, you can identify the sequence in which you want to address the issues. This priority score is categorized into confidence, importance and ease. So, when we're trying to talk about confident, we are trying to highlight that if you run this specific change in the test, how confident are you that you will get a result, right? So this is how you can give the confidence score. So one being the least confident and five being the maximum confidence level. Then talking about importance. So importance is like how important is your visitor landing up on the specific page where you are running the test, right? So this could be definitely important because we're trying to highlight the sign up form. Then when we talk about ease, we are trying to implement how easy is this to implement the change. So when you have to change or reduce the steps in your sign up form, is it really easy to implement? So one being the difficult level and five being the maximum. So let's say it might be a little difficult. So this way you can give it a priority score. Then you can give the URL of the page, upload supporting documents, add up labels and create a hypothesis. So once a hypothesis is created, you will see that it enters into the backlog lane. And then if you open up this, you will see that you get a priority score of 4.7 depending on the aggregate of the three criteria that you have selected. If you wish to edit this, delete this hypothesis, you can take the help of the options from here and modify the content. This is the workflow of the hypothesis. To know about this much in detail, please watch the next video. Thank you.